ever since Robert Goddard did pioneering experiments with rockets in the 1920s, engineers dreamed of sending them into space. During the Cold War, the Soviet Union launched the world's first artificial satellite, Sputnik 1. Not to be outdone, the United States soon followed, launching Explorer 1 a few months later. Today, there are thousands of satellites orbiting the planet, used for many things, such as communications, mapping, monitoring natural disasters and environmental change. But it wasn't until 1960 that satellite reconnaissance had finally been taken to new heights when the U.S. launched its first successful spy satellite mission. The USSR quickly followed. Today, many spy satellites are used for surveillance and intelligence gathering. Fitted with the latest high-tech gadgetry, they gather intelligence remotely using a variety of methods, weaving an intricate web of connectivity and surveillance that encircles the globe. What are the benefits of remote intelligence collection? 